Hi. Hey. Sorry I was a little late, but it looks like it's 6 o'clock, so we're going to get rolling. I'm going to get my, my crib notes. Hold on one second. All right. Okay. <laughs> you ready, Brian? I'm ready. Are you? Let's rock and roll. All right. Sounds good. Appreciate it. Uh, let me bring up the presentation. All right. Yeah, the now, will you be scrolling through the presentation? No. You normally do that. Do you need okay. me to do that for you? No. No. I got it. Okay. Now, where is the stock button? It's not on here. Do you have a little red button on yours? I do not. I uh, obviously the the phone I clicked that on no, it does show on. on air, but I do not see. There is no start button on either of our screens. Oh, never mind. I found it. It's in a new place. <laughs> I hope this is it. Nope. Hold on. Unless yeah, I don't see. No, we yeah, might be on here. Do you see us? Okay, so somebody must have started it because I had no start button. Okay. Yeah, I didn't know. I wish somebody would call me. So Brian must have started it. Okay. Yeah. We'll get started. Sorry, Sorry about that. All right, bye. Okay, bye. Hi, everybody. Welcome to Taylor Tuesday. Um, we've got a we've got a rookie on the call, and apparently he started it. And I was looking for a start button, so you've actually seen us jibber jabber. So, welcome to uh, uh, Taylor Tuesday tonight. Um, you know, with us I have Brian Alves, who's the national sales manager for Revere Shoes, and they've been a partner of of of, of Taylor Medical for quite some time. And um, so, I'm, I'll tell you a little bit more about Brian as soon as we get started with Taylor Medical. I want to tell you, of course, a little bit about Taylor. Um, and, you know, it's so, it's so hard to explain what I think Taylor is from, from where it was when we first started. Um, we, are, we are a Medicare Safe Harbor GPO. I know that probably means nothing to you, but um, what it means for us is that we get to negotiate with vendors to be able to try and get the best pricing that we can get. Uh, I'm not going to tell you that we're – the cheapest at everything we have, but we make an effort uh, to get you the best products at good prices. Um, but it's more than that. Um, we've become a family. We're not here to just get you a widget at a low price. We're here to teach you how to use those widgets and implement them into your practice. I'm sure Brian's going to talk about how you're going to implement um, appropriate shoe gear into your practice. That's kind of what we do. So if you haven't participated or you don't use Taylor, we don't charge anything. Um, it is free, and we are um, we're here to serve you. We want to make your practice and your practice experience better. We want to make things easier for your staff. We do a free cost analysis, so um, you know that's that's something that you do. And all these all the webinars that we're doing here, we archive them. If you come to our website, you can look at the top right hand corner where those. Big red arrows are telling you um, every webinar is archived. So if you watch the webinar tonight and you say, you know what, this is really good stuff, but my staff really needs to see this. You can actually play the webinar back for your staff. So everything is is archived. We've been doing this for, gosh, uh, almost two and a half years. Uh, it's It's been wonderful. We've got a lot of teamwork. We have a lot of um, our, our board members, our investors, our shareholders, they all help us out and, and help host these webinars. Um, you know, and as I, as I was saying is we do this free cost analysis. Um, all you got to do is reach out to Carla or to Ashley or to uh, Brooke, our newest team member, um, all of whom have a vast experience in podiatry. Um, they know the pitfalls and the problems that your staff have with ordering, with finding supplies, with getting things, um, that's what they do. That's their specialty. So if you 
put everything together and you you get if you're using certain places where you're ordering we can give you instructions on how to download it digitally and it makes it really easy if you just need want to send us invoices because you buy things from a company that just comes on invoices send it to us we'll put it together but basically we do need your vendor we do need the item description we need the manufacturer we need the unit of measure and the price and and we're gonna we're gonna do a free cost analysis for you um, one of the things I do want to talk about when we do this cost analysis, which is something unique, I, I, I think that what a lot of people don't understand is what we call aggregate savings. And what I mean by aggregate savings are we can do a cost analysis and we can show you that there is 18% savings. And but you see on that cost analysis that there are 30 items that maybe are not the cheapest price. If you know that there are a set items that you're purchasing already from another vendor, you know what, keep purchasing. But then that 18% savings we showed you is probably gonna go up to 25% because those 30 products that um, were not cost effective with, with, with our vendor it's fine. So I think that you need to understand and determine what is the value of your staff's time. And that's where Taylor does the work for you. Our staff does everything. We do the cost analysis. We help you um, source your products. And our goal is to make your staff more efficient at what they do, um, reduce the work that they're doing um, in the clinic so that they can focus on patient care and doing things with your patients. Um, so as I said, um, you know, uh, we're here for, um, to have Brian talk to us about Revere. Revere has been a, a longstanding partner with Taylor Medical. Um, I think they have wonderful shoes. Um, I wear them myself. Um, Brian is the national sales manager for, for, for Revere Shoes and has been with the company since 2018. He's responsible for training and growing sales in both the medical and retail spaces. Um, prior to joining Revere, he was with Clark for 18 years where he served in many roles, developing training programs and developing and launching new divisions within the company. Brian, I'm going to turn it over to you. I'm going to put my microphone off and I'm going to take my picture away and I'm going to pop on when you're done. And hopefully if we have any questions, we'll get them answered and we'll go from there. So right. thank you very Great. much for joining us tonight, Brian. Thank you. So, yes, I appreciate the opportunity to get in front of you. As Dr. Krauss mentioned, uh, I've been with Revere for several years now, and and you know what attracted me to Revere was you know we, I was at a, a trade conference a couple of years before I joined, and I didn't know Revere. They were fairly new to the United States, and when I first looked at the product on the table, I I saw the the genuine quality the quality of the features and benefits uh, the styling was relevant without being too too fashionable or too out there and i thought there's something here and i have to find out what what it is and how maybe one day i can be a part of it uh, so you know again thank you for having me uh, what i hope to share with you over the next uh, 20 minutes half hour or so is our story, how we came to being, uh, what we stand for, and how we deliver and what we deliver to our retail and medical partners. Uh, you know, as, as Dr. Krauss mentioned, he mentioned two words that uh, have already resonated with me, family and serving. And when I look at, you know, what, what we do in particular, uh, we, just like you, we solve problems, we provide solutions, but even more than that, you know, what we're really doing for, for our customers, our clients, and what you do is beyond the services and the products that you deliver and that you sell to your, to your clients and patients, what you're really doing is you're providing and selling really hope to them to lead a better and higher quality level of life. I mean, they seek you out uh, because they have some type of problem and they're looking to you to give them back what they once had. And we feel the same way. And 
so it's more than just selling a product or a service. It's really delivering that higher quality of life. And, uh, you know, at the end of the day, we all know that feet are our literal foundation of our body. And uh, we, we know that, you know, being the foundation of our body, uh, every part of our body is directly impacted by what's going on with our feet. So if we don't have the support, if we don't have the comfort, if we don't have the right pairs of, of shoes on our feet, then chances are something's going to happen to not just our feet, but our knees, hips, back. And I know I'm preaching to the choir, but I just you know want to deliver the message that you know being in this industry for uh, longer than I care to admit, although I will because I'm proud of it, almost 30 years and a lot of it on the training side, I've gotten to understand the ins and outs of, okay, how does the foot work and what goes on with it and how can I help deliver what a customer or a client is seeking? And a lot of times, uh, as you know, you know, our, our, the people that we deal with, you know, one of my favorite sayings is we don't know what we don't know. And I'm the expert for Revere. You're the expert in your practices. So it is really up to us to, to communicate and to teach uh, our clients really what's going on and how can we deliver the benefits that's going to improve their lives. So you know, as Dr. Krauss mentioned, we've been partners with Taylor for quite some time now. I think it's a natural fit. And I think we deliver the features and benefits that can, that can help support and deliver value to your business and to your clients. Uh, and just to, to you know, talk a little bit about the, the history of Revere, and you'll see how directly linked we are to the medical side. Uh, so we were founded in Australia back in 2012. And as you can imagine, in Australia, where they get to wear sandals for 12 months of the year, the company was founded on just a line of a few sandals. And the reason Revere was founded was that, you know, the founders saw a big need on the medical side of the business to not just create products that could accommodate custom orthotics or AFOs, but product that actually looks beautiful. And it's, it's, it's easy or somewhat easy for customers to find shoes and sneakers that are athletic or a little bit bulky or or orthopedic that can accommodate all that. But uh, for the most part back then, it was more challenging to find particularly sandals that women wanted to wear and could wear that could accommodate those orthotics. So uh, what I'd like to do is just sort of take you through, you know, some of the product in, in a minute or two and, and just show you our features and benefits and and how they might be able to support what you do and add value to your businesses. And you know, I've, I've been in sales and training for a long time and uh, learned early on that, you know, I, I don't like to, to call myself a salesman. You know, I do like to call myself uh, a problem solver and uh, somebody that can find a way to fulfill a client's needs. Now, that may not always happen, but I'm okay with that uh, because what I want to do and what Revere wants to do is is genuinely partner with you to add value and to to just help support everything that that you're doing. So, as I mentioned, you know what we do is we provide solutions and we add value. Uh, you know we understand that no two feet are the same. Uh, it's, it's something that's obvious to us, but it's not obvious to most humans. Uh, they don't understand how a foot is, is developed, how it's engineered, how it's supposed to work. Uh, they don't understand the walking gait. Uh, they don't understand that, you know, maybe one foot is a little bit shorter and wider. One foot is a little bit longer and, and skinnier. And uh, they just think 
that, okay, I'm going to go out, buy a pair of shoes, and it's going to work. And uh, they really don't understand, um, you know, how to really look for or discover what's appropriate for them unless they're visiting you or visiting a, a premium retailer that, that has the staff on hand to be able to talk to them, understand their needs, understand how their lifestyles are, and to be able to, to fulfill those needs. So understanding that no two feet are the same, you know, we've developed a personalized fitting kit. And that personalized fitting kit, which I'll show you, uh, comes in every box of sandals, shoes, booties, sneakers that we have. And what is contained in our personalized fitting kit are a few items, you know, one of which is a sized filler kit. So based on the fact that no two feet are the same, maybe one foot, one shoe has a little bit too much volume in it. So now with, with our shoes, 95% uh, of our styles have removable footbeds. And what you would do is if there's a little bit too much volume in one shoe or both, but not enough to go down a size, you would use these sized full length fillers to put underneath the footbed to take up just a little bit of volume. And this accommodates half sizes. So Revere, we engineer and, and design all of our products on a, on a Euro last. So they're whole sizes only, which is great for you because uh, you don't have to carry a, a large amount of inventory to be able to support your client's needs. Uh, and then on top, we also have a four foot filler that can be used in the front underneath the footbed, which will help keep the, the heel, the foot in the back of the shoe uh, in the heel, heel counter to allow the heel counter to support the, the foot and to reduce that, that heel slippage. So that goes in every, every box of, of shoes and booties that we have. Uh, now for sandals and also for footwear that has any type of strap, uh, which all of our sandals have multiple straps for adjustability, uh, we also have created a strap extender kit, which comes like this. So our strap extenders uh, are designed, might be a little bit tough to see, but are designed and engineered in the same shape, size, color, finish of every strap that's on our products. So for instance, our emerald, which I have here, has three adjustable straps. Each strap has a slightly different shape to it and length. So our strap extenders also match with each strap. Now the strap extenders will be provided for each and every strap within the sandal. So the emerald here has three adjustable straps, so six for the pair. So there will be six strap extenders that are, that are included in our strap extender kit and our personalized fill, fitting system. And just to demonstrate, because um, this, this really blew me away when you know, I first became familiar with Revere. So we all know that, that let's say a, a client of yours comes in and, and they see a really nice looking sandal Maybe they have a wider forefoot and maybe with the orthotics or the AFOs that they're uh, required to use that you're developing for them. Uh, maybe the, the forefoot is a little bit wide and does not accommodate the existing strap. And when she tries it on, she has that exposed hook and loop. And as many of us know, it really creates almost a reason for her not to buy it. She loves the, the look, she loves the style. It works well with, with her orthotic or her AFO, but because the strap just doesn't come all the way over, she, it really is a, is a turnoff and that reason not to buy. So the strap extender provides a little bit more than 
a half inch of additional adjustability. So all you have to do is undo the strap. The strap extender will adhere to the underside like such. And then she has that additional half inch and without taking anything away from the styling or the look of the, of the sandal, you've got the ability to personalize and customize that fit and feel for her. And maybe she just needs that strap extender on one strap. Maybe it's just across the forefoot, maybe it's the forefoot and across the instep. Uh, so it gives her the ability to, again, personalize that fit and feel. And it really has been an amazing uh, ability to provide the benefit of giving and providing our customer with what they've been looking for all along. Uh, I've been in situations and many here have been in uh, situations on, on the selling floor or in an office where, you know, a woman uh, maybe has been forced into choosing styles that maybe just weren't for her, but she didn't have many options. And this gives her just an amazing level of comfort, but also, and probably more importantly, confidence that she has her life back, that she can now uh, look and feel the way she wants, not look and feel the way she has to, which uh, has, has been a really important uh, element to, to what we do. We're, we're really, like I mentioned in the beginning, we're really providing uh, hope and giving our clients the ability to get back what they maybe have either lost or uh, maybe have, you know, given up, you know, in, in the way of activities or a lifestyle that she wishes she had back. Um, and now, now she can. So that is, is probably one of the biggest wow factors in our products. Uh, the other is that the majority of our sandals and all of our footwear and booties have removable footbeds. So again, we wanted to design a system that could accommodate orthotics and braces. So our footbeds, which are hook and loop in here, and if you can hear that, the hook and loop is uh, pretty substantial. And you, you may be providing the orthotics for them. So you might not need our footbeds, but I just wanted to point out that, you know, our footbeds have been engineered and developed with foot experts to provide a level of support and comfort without being corrective. So we're not looking to fix any issues that a client might have. Uh, but what we do want to provide is a nice deep heel cup so that it properly aligns the foot and then an arch profile that gives her the proper support underneath. Now, one other thing is that we also create just a little divot here so that it helps through the walking gait by uh, allowing in a more comfortable and natural way for our customers to uh, be able to walk smoother, more comfortably, uh, more flexibly you know, with the support and comfort that they, they are looking for. So, and I just wanted to show uh, how deep the heel counter is uh, because again, we have engineered all of our, most of our styles to be orthotic and brace friendly. Um, and this is a fairly structured orthotic that I have here. And as you can see, it fits beautifully in the cavity of the construction. And then you would put your a cushioned top cover on it and you're good to go. So it, it really is uh, an amazing ability and um, gives us the opportunity again to, to give her back, which maybe she was, was missing. 
So, and here's here's what is included as I've I've gone through just a uh, little bit clearer uh, visual for you. Uh, you can see, you know, our footbeds. You can see the full length and the four foot fillers, the strap extenders in our footwear as well as our booties. We also include a, a shoehorn. So it's not just about adding value to you know, your businesses or the retailers that we work with each and every day, but also we want to provide and add value to our customers' lives as well. So as you can see here, you know, along with our the elements of our personalized fitting system, uh, we do and have evolved Revere uh, quite a bit over the last several years. As I mentioned back in, in 2012, and even when Craig and Andy, Annie, who are two of the three founding partners of Revere, uh, when Craig and Annie came over here uh, to see what opportunity they had in the States, uh, they brought one bag and they brought four sandals with them. And that's all Revere was made up of was just those few sandals. And what we now have evolved to is a lifestyle brand that offers not just sandals, but year round product, uh, dress casual to casual uh, slippers and booties, uh, not slippers, sorry, uh, slip on loafers and booties, as well as some performance lifestyle uh, categories that we have with with true walking features and benefits and and styles that can take take her uh, almost every anywhere she wants to go. Uh, we have also developed an uh, a men's line, and this is just one of three sandals in the men's collection that we have. Uh, the Montana 2, which is our traditional three-strap sandal. Uh, this also comes with all of our features and benefits and the personalized fitting system, the removable footbed, the strap extenders, all that. And then recently, so recently that we are now delivering this, uh, this March for the very first time, is a men's line of shoes. And we're starting out with the Hudson which is a, a beautiful dress casual knit upper with a touch of cognac leather on the back uh, and just super lightweight. I know you can't feel the, the weight of this, but uh, it's got an EVA midsole, uh, really nice rubber tabs here for traction and stability, super flexible and lightweight. Uh, I was at a conference this past weekend I wore these both days that I was there and, and really felt like I was wearing sneakers. So we're, we're looking forward to, to this coming up. So I wanted to touch on our lifestyle athletic category because, um, you know, we felt obviously over the last few years in particular with, with the pandemic and, and uh, just really the evolution of, of the styling of footwear in general over the last 10 or 20 years, probably more, uh, the direction has been to go a little bit more casual. And um, athletic, as we all know, has been a huge category. Uh, it only continues to grow. And we felt that with our technology and our designs, that it made sense not to become another athletic brand. Uh, there's enough out there uh, most of them do a great job and and provide the categories and the, the styling that, that people wear every day. Uh, but what we wanted to do, based on the fact that, uh, you know, on the women's side, we know that uh, not all women want to wear an athletic brand every day or on the weekends or at soccer games or shopping or whatever they're doing. But we know that you know, customers, all customers now, uh, do not compromise when it comes to the comfort and the benefits that are delivered in what they wear. So what we wanted to do was come out with a line that uh, 
looked a little bit more casual to dress casual, but delivered all of the features and benefits that a, a true athletic walking shoe delivers. And we stand up to this category. Uh, we support this 100%. And um, you know, I wanted to, to show you a couple of styles that, that are in this collection. Uh, but first, I wanted to show you uh, the actual construction. So, because it's important to understand that we did develop uh, the ingredients and the features and benefits that would allow a customer to be able to walk all day, every day in comfort uh, in, our, in our sneakers. So our construction starts with uh, a rubber outsole that has actually been tested for slip resistance to water. Now it does not pass for oil and we do not sell this as a duty shoe. Uh, because of that, we really did not have the intent to develop a duty program uh, for you know kitchens, restaurants, hospitality. But we knew that our rubber compound that we used is super slip resistant. So we tested it to see what would happen and it passed with flying colors uh, for the slip resistance for water. But you can see the, the flex grooves here, and then it has an EVA mid, so it provides a ton of cushioning and shock absorbing absorption. And then on top of the midsole, we have two additional layers of cushioning here. Now EVA, as you know, because I'm sure you sell a lot of, of athletic brands, EVA is used in most athletic products. Um, we took it a step further. So the additional layers here are made of poron. So it's a little bit less dense than EVA. Uh, it feels like a pillow. So it adds just another layer of shock absorption and cushioning under the, the two biggest strike points, the ball of the foot and the heel. And then we have a nice airport friendly shank here that provides some torsional control. And then although you may not be using our footbeds, although this one is a little bit thinner, uh, so for some orthotics, this would work great over the top. Um, we have our comfort supportive footbed and then with another layer of pour on under the heel. So I, I wanted to point these elements out because it's not just about creating, designing, manufacturing, developing products that look good and feel good for a short period of time. Um, our product is developed and engineered to develop, to deliver the, the features and benefits that uh, customers don't even know they want, don't even know that they need them. And, and we provide them. And, and you know, I think what's pretty cool is that uh, the, the construction and, and the benefits that we deliver are hidden in the shoe. Again, we want to come out with really nice looking products that women would feel comfortable wearing, shopping on holiday, get soccer games. So uh, one of the styles that I wanted to point out, which is the Boston, which is a really cool looking sneaker that has a combination of this one, Sapphire Lizard, and then the smooth lizard. It's a functional lace with the side zip. So it all you have to do is lace it up once and then it's really easy on and off for that customer that maybe has a little bit more challenge to getting in and out of shoes or has orthotics and just wants something that's uh, just a little easier to work with. So this works really well. Our Haiti, which we developed and launched a couple of seasons ago, uh, has been doing well. This is a little bit more athletic inspired, but it doesn't shout Revere. Obviously, it doesn't shout any other athletic brands, but uh, just looks neat and just a fun spring, summer, fall, athletic lifestyle performance shoe. Uh, the conference that I was at this past weekend, 
one of the women, a uh, diehard Revere wearer, and we did a 5K walk, and uh, that's what she wore. And she was comfortable, supportive, her feet didn't hurt, and she did a great job with them. A um, couple other styles real quick um, are Virginia, which is a, again, on the same construction, uh, but the Virginia has a elasticized top strap that is a, just a great travel shoe. Again, easy on off and the ability to adjust the strap as needed. Uh, we know that feet swell throughout the day and to be able to adjust as needed and, and adjust easily is something that we considered and implemented in our, our styles. Uh, we also came out with a, a cup sole version on this construction. Um, the outsole is a little bit different, but it's the same construction as our lifestyle performance group. So it's got the built-in multi-layer cushioning system and our comfort supportive footbed. So just a couple of styles there. And then just to stay on, just showing you a couple of styles, a uh, couple of styles within the our sandal range. You know, we we showed you. Um, so this is you know another color in the emerald, uh, which is our number one selling sandal, and has been for some some time now. But we've got a uh, lot of different styles in this collection of removable footbeds are orthotic and AFO friendly collection. So the Rio, which is a two strap slide. Our Como, which offers just a little bit of uh, a wider four foot strap that just has a little bit different, different foot covering. Uh, we know that some women with bunions don't like to show the, the bunion. So uh, it just provides her with the opportunity to cover it. We know women uh, that may have orthotics or AFOs uh, want a little bit more stability and security. So we have a couple of different closed back options, but gives her that ability to wear something that's beautiful, that accommodates her orthotics but also gives her that stability and security that she's looking for. So those are just a few, few of our sandals in the range. Um, and then a couple other, couple booties I wanted to show you. You know, our Damascus, which is new for autumn 23. Uh, this color is new for autumn 23, the boot itself has been out for a few seasons now um, just a beautiful finish with the medial zip and a lateral i'm sorry medial stretch panel here and lateral zip here but again everything we do is in an effort to make it easy for our clients our customers to uh, get in and out of their shoes Something new for Autumn, the Timaru, which is a Mary Jane adjustability with the strap, strap extender. Um, we've got a neoprene stretch panel here that goes over the bunion. So it gives her that flex, not only the flexibility, but the instant fit and comfort that she's looking for that she doesn't have to worry about if she does have a bunion. Uh, we also offer it here in our Naples, which came out about three or four seasons ago. So the neoprene actually comes across the forefoot and then down over the bunion area. So again, giving her that instant and all day comfort. So I don't know if anybody has any questions or uh, I do have some slides with, with more product that I can, I can flip through, uh, but and I didn't know, you know if anybody had um, any questions, comments, or uh, anything that that you know you might want to ask or uh, comment on. 
Um, I'll just you know flip through these these slides here just to show you, and I've showed you a lot of these, uh, but just some of the product that we've had in the line or new for autumn winter. Uh, but you can see that you know we really have evolved into a lifestyle brand. We're not just a sandal company. Uh, we are not just a, a company that has has a few year round shoes and and booties, but something that uh, you know a brand that can really provide uh, a lot of what our customers are looking for. Uh, just you know some testimonials I wanted to share with you uh, that really hit home on you know on our products being uh, not just orthotic friendly, but uh, really filling and fitting the needs of, of our customers. Uh, and even our AFOs, you know, work beautifully with our, particularly our closed back sandals. And uh, it's not easy to do, but we we thought that it was important enough to uh, create, design, and engineer products that, again, uh, could accommodate orthotics and braces, but more importantly, uh, look beautiful as well. Brian, I've got a couple of questions I want to ask you. Just out of curiosity, um, what is the price point on the on the shoes and sandals? Because obviously, um, uh, I think um, when we're going to be putting these products in our office, um, it is going to be something that's a cash pay service. Mm -hmm. And um, um, I'm just uh, I'm wondering what what the range is when 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 you, and um, do you have like a recommended um, um, profile of shoes that you recommend people start out with? How, how, how does all that work? Yeah. So from a pricing standpoint, you know, our, our sandals range from about 140 to 170 uh, on the closed back styles. Our footwear, our year round footwear is in about the same range, uh, depending upon the style, the mid hundreds. Our booties are a little bit more at 180, uh, but you know again the the features and the benefits and the personalized fitting system that we developed and include at no cost to you or to a, to your clients, um, you know there's there's a, just a ton of value that goes into our products, uh, but you know once if if there's any objection, which you know I know on our retail side. Uh, many customers of ours or retail partners have asked us to uh, just keep increasing our prices because of just, you know, what they need to do. But uh, we want to be able to offer products that are are in the <clears throat> mid range, but deliver all the bells and whistles. And yes, we uh, we do have a recommended assortment uh, that, you know, it, it obviously depending upon the season and depending upon your needs. Uh, we start out with, you know, two or three sandals, a uh, couple of year round products, you know, one or two men's and and you're good to go. And um, so, you know, I just saw, saw the one one question and, and is that our cost or the retail cost? Those are retails. So the wholesale costs are 50 percent of that. And certainly I can provide you with all of that information. Uh, and again, a recommendation of, of uh, you know, what you might start out with. Uh, Brian, how, how do the shoes fit from the standpoint? Like, and, and I'm asking because I know that when I used to do certain shoes in the clinic, we got an array of shoes that it were different sizes, but most of the fit was identical. So that if you were wearing a, you know, if, if, I, if I ran a size tree of, you know, you know, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I'm just using that as an example. And maybe I had four different styles, but they were true to size. So I, do your mm -hmm. shoes do that as well so that you can have an array of sizes that allows clients to at least try on the size and then say, oh, well, it's true to fit. Since this size fits you, you mm -hmm. can get this style. Yeah, no, great question. And within each category, that is true. Uh, now, you know, <laughs> if I show you... You know, three different sandals on that same construction, then yes, it's it's true to fit in our sandals. 
you can be confident that if she's a size nine in one sandal, that she's going to be a size nine in every other sandal that's appropriate for, for your businesses. Uh, now with some of our closed up product, uh, it might, like we have fitting suggestions that, okay, if she's a half size, then um, certainly in our more athletic driven line, if she's a half size, we would recommend going up to the next size instead of going down. Uh, but again, in that category, it's pretty consist consistent. And as is in our, our year round product and booties, uh, we really just have with our, with our year round product and our booties, we uh, really just have two different constructions. So you're going to find a, a lot of consistency. I will say that, you know, our, our couple of new items for fall um, have a little bit wider base and a little bit more depth in the toe box. Um, but for the most part, you know, the, they're true to size within their category. Nice. Now, none of these shoes are any, any shoes that would qualify for a diabetic shoe program. Am I correct? Or do you're, are... Yeah, you're correct. Um, so we certainly have looked at that, but uh, with, with all of the requirements and in particular, uh, with the requirement of the the number of width fittings that you need, uh, they're not. So we okay. we have uh, everything. Not, nothing wrong with that. I was just asking. I know some yeah. people want to know if the shoes can be used in a diabetic shoe program, mm -hmm. <clears throat> as opposed to just you know uh, uh, you know as a cash pay you know offering for patients. Yeah, yeah. No, it's a great question, and you know the way we've developed our our line. Um, you know, most actually everything that I've shown you comes in medi both mediums and wides and particularly on the sandals uh, with our strap extenders, you can take a medium and bring it to a wide or a wide to an extra wide. Right. So that's, that's the reason why we didn't we didn't do a you know, medium <clears throat> wide, extra wide last. Uh, as far as the removable inserts go, um... Uh, do you work with any of the, or do you have any arrangements with any of the orthotic companies? Because I know sometimes, you know, orthotics, you know, custom orthotic might not fit unless they send the shoe out and not uh, not promoting anybody but you. Do you have a, any type of partnership or anything with any type of orthotic company so that if people are going to wear custom orthotics and they need custom orthotics, they can benefit from the maximum medical um uh orthotic device that they need and wear in the shoes that they like mm -hmm. no direct link i mean we certainly have retail partners that specialize in custom orthotics and uh, our products work very well with their orthotics and uh you know we have in the past have been able to uh, send them you know, which we can do for you if 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 your business has that type of service that we could send our last template to you uh, so that, you know, you can uh, match it, match it as close to perfect as possible. Nice. Nice. Um, well, <clears throat> I personally have worn your shoes and um, I, I, as a testimonial, I was um, uh, very pleased with, with the shoes that I, that I, that I had. Um, and, uh, I think that, you know, being able to have this type of, um, um, product line for your patients, you know, it, you know, it is, 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 a, is a great advantage. I mean, cause most of the patients that are coming into you, they don't just want guidance on how to get better. They want to know what kind of shoes they can wear that they're going to be comfortable in, but yet still, you know, have a little pizzazz with it. Mm. No, that's it. You know, I, I love that you brought that up because, uh, you know, what I find interesting, you know, as I mentioned, you know, my one of my favorite sayings, we don't know what we don't know. And for your type of service industry, which, you know, you're you're enhancing people's qualities of lives, you're giving them back hope, you're giving them back confidence, a comfort level that maybe they haven't had in a long time. And you know, I think the last thing you want to do, and obviously, I'd love to be able to provide revere to everybody, but you know, the last thing I think you should do is is to give them the service, the products that you do so well with and then send them out into the big, bad world and for them to fend for themselves to figure out 
how is how and where and what is this orthotic or device or whatever it might be what's it going to work with right because they don't know no listen i i agree and you know it's and 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 i think that um this this whole um um you know i i think practices in general are trying to become you know one-stop shops full service and be able to you know provide the patients you know <clears throat> with what they need um, you know early in my career you know i knew local shoe stores in my community that i knew provided decent quality shoes that mm-hmm. we could do with patients before we had the opportunity to 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 put these type of um shoes in our in our offices and set them mm-hmm. up so um yeah. i i think that it's um something that is um well received by patients um i i i will think i do say that sometimes it's uh depends on the demographics of a community where your practice is located. Um, and I think that um, uh, those have to be taken into consideration, but um, I, I don't think that, um, I don't think you left anything out, Brian. I think you offered some really good solutions. Um, I can definitely say that the products have, have significantly um, grown since you guys started. Oh, yeah. And, um, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's nice to see when a company is successful and growing and has a good product. So, uh, I think that's the most important thing to us and, and our and, and our members. Mm-hmm. So um, I don't know if you have any closing comments. You know, we we don't always go the full hour. Sometimes we just don't get a lot of questions. And um, yeah. I think that you've you've explained everything. But if there's any closing comments before I finish up, I just wanted to see if you had anything else that you want to say to anybody. Well, just just thirty seconds. You know, uh, you know, we we pride ourselves on being genuine partners with whether or not it's our medical partnerships or our retail partnerships, uh, we're here for you. So, uh, you know, as I mentioned, uh, we would love everybody to carry Revere, but Revere doesn't work for everybody. So if we can fulfill the needs for your customers, uh, we're here for you. Um, you know, we, we do have a great line of sandals, shoes, booties, sneakers, uh, and, and we are a lifestyle brand and, and we, have the categories that that can help support what you do and what your clients needs are and uh, we do add quite a bit of value to what you already do uh, and and you know we're here to support what you do and uh, you know, I just did wanted to thank you for the opportunity uh, because it you know it's just a natural fit it's a natural connection well so we, we, we we thank you for being a partner to Taylor Medical. Um, we appreciate that Revere um, joined us early on and they've been with us for quite some time. And um, I know that not every practice provides this type of service and it's our job to educate them and show them what's available and what's out there. Yeah. So I want to thank you very much for your time. Um, I want to thank everybody for joining us tonight on Taylor Tuesday. Um, we'll see you back next month with Dr. Neil Lonke. Um, Neil uh, helped develop a device. He's a um, a uh, gynecological oncologist who developed a special debridement device that we are using um, on our diabetic patients and our wound care patients in our practices uh, that have made um, debridement uh, a little bit easier than, than what we've traditionally done. So um, I want to thank everybody for joining us. I hope that if you have not had a cost analysis done recently, you'll send in your information to do a cost analysis. and. Um, If you have any questions, I'm sure Brian will be more than happy to provide you with uh, any information that you need. You can contact us at Taylor Medical, and we'll make sure that Brian gets all your information. And, um, Brian, thank you very much for joining us, and I'm sure I'll see you at a trade show sometime soon. Yes, definitely. Appreciate it. Thank you. Bye, everybody. See ya. Brian, you got to turn it off. You got the on-off button. (laughs) There it is.